हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल आज मैं फिर से इंडियन जियोग्राफी टॉपिक के ऊपर क्वेश्चन लेकर आई हूँ जो कि मैंने इसका पहला वीडियो अपलोड कर दिया है और वहाँ पे मैंने टोटल 25 क्वेश्चन रखा था तो इस बार मैं 26 नंबर क्वेश्चन से शुरू करने वाली हूँ दोस्तों और दोस्तों पहले वाले वीडियो को जिस किसी ने भी नहीं देखा है उसका मैं लिंक डिस्क्रिप्शन के अंदर दे दूँगी आप सब लोग जाके विजिट कर सकती हो और दोस्तों ये वाला वीडियो भी आप सभी को बहुत ही पसंद आएंगे मैं दिल से आशा करती हूँ अगर पसंद आए तो प्लीज़ लाइक शेयर कमेंट एंड हो सके तो सब्सक्राइब भी कीजिए और वीडियो को बिना स्किप किए ही देखना है दोस्तों क्योंकि वीडियो के बीच में मैं क्वेश्चन पूछूंगी जिसका आंसर आप सभी को कॉमेंट बॉक्स में देना है सो नो लेट स्टार्ट अ वीडियो विदाउट वेस्ट in the time question number 26 the chinese river known as yellow river is correct answer option b that is hawang ho hawang ho is also called sorrow of china because millions of people have been killed due to the flood caused by river Question number twenty-seven. Which of the following peninsular rivers is westward flowing? Correct answer option A. Tapti. Tapti is a river in central India located to the south of the Narmada River that flows westward before draining into the Arabian Sea. Question number twenty-eight. Which of the following is the heaviest planet in the solar system? Correct answer. Option C. Jupiter. So Jupiter, it is the fifth planet from Sun, and it has largest mass and volume. Question number twenty-nine. Volcanoes are scattered. Correct answer option A on the island. Composite volcanoes are most commonly found in island areas. Most of them are found scattered on the island adjoining the Pacific Ring of Fire where about 75% of Earth's volcanoes are found. Question number thirty. Great Barrier Reef of Australia is located in. Correct answer option D. North East Coast. The Great Barrier Reef is a site of remarkable variety and beauty on the North East Coast of Australia. Question number thirty-one. The state which is known as the Granary of India is. Correct answer. Option B. That is Punjab. Punjab is called the Granary of India due to the alluvial deposit. Punjab is one of the most fertile regions in India. Therefore, the land creates an environment favorable for crop production. Question number thirty-two. Which are the west-flowing rivers of southern India which flow into Arabian Sea? Correct answer. Option D. That is Narmada and Tapti. The two major west-flowing rivers are the Narmada and the Tapi. Tapi, also known as Tapti. This exceptional behavior is because these rivers did not form valleys and instead they flow through falls that is linear rift rift valley trough created due to the bending of the northern peninsula during the formation process of Himalayas Question number 33 the Pollavaram project is located in which state Correct answer option C Andhra Pradesh Pollavaram or Prolavaram is a village in Eluru district of the Indian state of Andhra Pradesh it is located in Pollavaram mandal of Zangiredi Gudem revenue division at about 35 km away from the banks of Godavari river the Papi hills and the Pollavaram project are the major landmarks near the village And also, the Pollavaram project is a multi-purpose, a major terminal reservoir project on River Godavari for the development of irrigation, hydropower, and drinking water facilities to the East Godavari 
Visakapatnam, West Godavari, and Krishna district of Andhra Pradesh. Question number 34. The highest peak of the Himalayas are found in? Correct answer, option D, Nepal. So, Mount Everest, because even though it is the highest mountain peak in the Himalayas and the world with an altitude of 8,848 meters, it is geographically located in Nepal. Question number 35. Kanchipuram is in which of the following states? Correct answer. Option D. Tamil Nadu. Kanchipuram, otherwise known as Kanchi, previously romanized as Kanchipuram, Konjivaram, is a city in the Indian state of Tamil Nadu, 72 km from Chennai, the capital of Tamil Nadu, and the city covers an area that is 11.605 square km. Question number 36. Coal is found in? Correct answer, option C, that is sedimentary rock. So coal is the world's largest energy sources as well as fossil fuel. It contains a lot of carbon and hydrocarbon which contains energy that can be released by fire or you can say heat. Question number 37. Pork trade separates. Correct answer. Option A that is India and Sri Lanka. The Pork Strait is a strait between India and Sri Lanka. It connects the Bay of Bengal in the northeast with the Gulf of Mannar in the southwest. This chain extends between Danuskodi on Pamban that is Rameshwaram Island in Tamil Nadu and Mannar Island in Sri Lanka. Question number 38. India leads the world in the export of Correct answer, option A, mica. So, mica common in igneous and metamorphic rock and is occasionally found as small flakes in sedimentary rock. Question number 39. The city of Surat is located on the bank of river. Correct answer. Option D. That is Tapi or you can say Tapti. So Surat is a large city and also a commercial center for textiles. River Tapti flows through Surat, Gujarat. Tapti discharges its water into the Arabian Sea. Question number 40. Which of the following important centers of pilgrimage is not situated on the bank of the river Ganges? And the correct answer is option D, that is Mathura. So Mathura is a sacred city in Uttar Pradesh, northern India, the deity Lord Krishna's Janma Bhumi, and also situated along the bank of the river Yamuna, not situated on the bank of the river Ganga. Question number 41. Which one of the following ports is located on the eastern coast of India? Correct answer. Option C. That is Paradip ports. So Paradip port is a natural deep water port on the east coast of India in Paradip. Just 35 km from Jagatsinpur city in Jagatsinpur district of Orissa, India. It is at the confluence of Mahanadi River and the Bay of Bengal. Question number 42. Nasik is situated on the bank of the river. Correct answer option C that is Godavari. So Godavari is best known for being one of Hindu pilgrimage sites that of Kumbh Mela held every 12 years. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी थ्री द साउथ एंड मोस्ट पॉइंट ऑफ पेन इन सुलर इंडिया दैट इज कन्याकुमारी इज करेक्ट आंसर ऑप्शन डी दैट इज नॉट ऑफ द इक्वेटर कन्याकुमारी इज ए स्मॉल टाउन लोकेटेड इन तमिलनाडु व्हिच इज सराउंडेड बाय अरेबियन सी एंड बे ऑफ बंगाल कन्याकुमारी इज आल्सो नोन एज द केप कोमोरिन व्हिच इज साउथर्न टिप ऑफ इंडिया क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी फोर मैनग्रोव फॉरेस्ट ऑकर इन करेक्ट आंसर ऑप्शन डी दैट इज कॉस्टल स्वाम्स सो मैनग्रोव फॉरेस्ट इज आल्सो कॉल्ड मैनग्रोव स्वाम ग्रोस मेनली एट ट्रॉपिकल एंड सब ट्रॉपिकल लेटिट्यूड्स बिकॉज इट कैन नॉट विथ स्टैंड इम्प्रीजिंग टेम्परेचर्स Question number forty-five. The highest volcano of the world is. Correct answer option D. That is a Mount Cotopaxi. So Mount Cotopaxi is a symmetrical cone and it is around five thousand nine hundred eleven meters, whereas Kilimanjaro is five thousand eight hundred. Ninety-five meter and Mount Fujiyama, that is three thousand seven hundred seventy-six meter, and Mount Etna, that is three thousand three hundred fifty-seven meter. So among these, uh, Mount Kotopaxi is five thousand nine hundred eleven meter. So this is the highest volcano of the world. Question number forty-six. What is lagoon? So, दोस्तों जैसे कि मैंने आप सभी को पहले ही बताया कि मैं कुछ वीडियो के बीच में एक क्वेश्चन पूछूंगी तो ये है वो क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज लैगुन ऑप्शन डिया है लेक स्प्रिंग वाटरफॉल एंड पॉन्ट तो इसका आंसर आप सभी को कमेंट बॉक्स में देना है विद एन एक्सप्लेनेशन नाउ प्रोसीड टू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टी सेवन ब्लैक फॉरेस्ट आर फाउंड इन करेक्ट आंसर ऑप्शन सी डेट इज जर्मनी सो Black Forest it is a mountainous region with dense evergreen forest in southwest Germany bordering France and surrounded by Rhine valley Question number 48 Port city of Kandla is located on the Correct answer option A that is Gulf of Kutch Kanla is a port city in the Kutch district of Gujarat, India. Question number forty-nine. Name the sea whose boundaries touches three continents. Correct answer option B. That is Mediterranean Sea. Mediterranean Sea is bordered on the north by Europe, the east by Asia, and in the south by Africa. So, question number fifty: The distance between the Earth and the Sun is smallest in the month of. Correct answer option B. That is January. As the Earth reaches perihelion, its closest point to the Sun in its yearly orbit. So, those two ask के लिए इतना ही मैंने यहाँ पे total twenty five questions ही रखा है. So, अगर आप सभी को मेरी ये video अच्छी लगे तो please like, share, comment and हो सके तो subscribe भी कीजिए. So, thank you for watching.